right. So, I guess I'll complete the trilogy here. So now, you guys by now, you guys now have seen the mole. And you've seen the setup for the mole. So now we'll just go ahead and we'll complete and tell you guys what eventually happened with the mole. After that brilliant display at the water cooler and slinking off into the shadows, of course the drones are going to be like, Hey boss, this just happened at the water cooler. We saw somebody in a trench coat with guns. <laughs> so like, okay, well, we'll let security know about this person. Be advised, every one of them has one of those cool trench coats that I talked about. And guns. <laughs> Be advised, they're on different levels. They have split the party. <laughs> one's in the dormitory. One's in a different dormitory. The other two are on the same level. So, of course, security's like, okay, we're all going to be on the lookout. One of them, the one, that the one that went to the different dormitory floor, the very first thing he sees is he sees two janitors just kind of sitting there talking. They look over at him and they put up the wet don't go this way sign and resume talking. I figured it'd be a good joke where he'd just, you know, walk on by or do something or maybe just, you know, find some way to secretly kill them. No, he just stands there. So they're sitting there, they're talking about, hey, did you see what happened on bottom last night? Yeah, that was pretty funny. Rick Bale's pretty funny. Ha 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 ha. When their radios crackle, they're like, okay, be on the lookout. Notify us if you see somebody wearing a trench coat with visible guns. Yeah, we seen him. <laughs> so he whips out his uh, M4 assault rifle and just like, just opens fire on the two guys. Because somebody's out the window at this point. <laughs> Alarm, you know, klaxons start blaring, alarms going off left and right. So everyone else is like, Eh, screw it. Whipped out their guns. They start opening fire on people. To be fair, this this was one of their plans. Specifically, it was the mole's idea originally to just go walking down the halls, blam, 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 blam. The mole and Sephiroth, they start going around, and they actually get an idea. We'll hack the computers and find out what safe rooms the targets that we need are supposed to go to. So they're doing that. Meanwhile, you know, security is like flooding in and they're having to hold off security. Uh, the robot, all by himself, who's lost, is just walking around, engaging security left and right because they know where he is and he don't know where he is. They eventually find the locations of these places and uh, so they go to the nearest one and they just, you know, open the door, you know. I think they like throw a grenade in, blam, you know, everyone's dead inside, the innocent civilians as well as the targets, but, you know, who cares. About this time, the robot goes down because, turns out, if there's wave upon wave upon wave of enemies coming, at, coming after you, even if they're only doing one damage, eventually they're going to take you down. So he goes down, and uh, the uh, hacker thinks quickly and hacks the elevator, so the elevator comes down to their floor where they just, you know, murder the security guards and they meet up. And eventually they're like, hey, we should probably go find M4. Meanwhile, uh, M4 is also kind of running around trying to find people. M4ing people as he goes. Eventually it boils down to in like the big like exercise area. There's like a big, you know, indoor sport auditorium. It was a very big modern building, you know, almost an arcology. There is this big barricade, because, and they're like, what? Why is there this big barricade that's like got superior defense and so hard for us to break through? Almost like there's four ass that have been going around, you know, murdering the safe rooms. So the biggest safe room has like, you know, good defenses at it. So eventually they gun down this like massive barricade and kill like all these guys. And they just kick open the door to the safe room. And rather than look around, M4 just runs up and just like unloads his M4 on this place. Now, in Genesis, uh, one of the things that automatic weapons have is if you get two advantage, you get a second hit. And every two advantage you get, you know, you can spend that to get another hit because it's an automatic weapon. So he rolls. He hits, and he gets like 
20 advantage. He kind of looks at it, it's like, I spend it all on automatic fire. <laughs> um, you can imagine the result. And they're like, well, we're done here. Let's leave. But yeah, now you know the rest of the story. Um, I'm the DM and, uh, uh, um, ta-ta for now. Uh, it is. Uh, it's probably a good thing because, I mean, I think, I, I think their final body toll was like, I think they, I, I like calculated it up. It was like, I think like 25 like people that they needed to kill, like maintenance crew that they needed to kill, you know? And I think they ended up killing like 90 security guards alone. Bloodiest movie ever. Yeah, they killed a lot of people. It's amazing what you can do with unlimited ammo. Why did they have unlimited ammo? Uh, because that's the way Genesis works. Dude. Yeah. We should play Genesis. We should play Genesis. Yeah, we should play Genesis. I've been trying to get you to play Genesis. <laughs> um, yeah, the way the way it works is 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 most guns, unless like, unless it specifically says that it has ammo to it, it, it just considers it having unlimited ammo, unless like you roll a despair or a significant amount of uh, threat, like the DM can be like, okay, I'm going to spend that to have you run out of ammo, in which case they can just reload and resume shooting. Oh. And there's a talent that's like, okay, I ignore that. <laughs> but there's also a talent that I liberally use that every bad guy has where I can spend two threat to be like, hey, you forgot to count, you're out of ammo now. Wow. <laughs>